Hey guys, I'm recording in my living room so don't mind me. I just wanted to do a mini haul for you guys and show you guys what I got today. This ain't all the stuff that was in that drawer. Will you go get the rest of it? Okay, let's continue. I got, um, I'll start with just the drugstore stuff. I got a new, um, I found these at Walmart. I usually order these online. I use this to set my concealer under my eyes. This is the high definition under eye setting powder from e.l.f. And I haven't found anything else that works better than this stuff right here. This is like magic. It doesn't like, well, not all day, but I could say for a good eight hours, um, it, there is no creasing under my eye. Not eight, maybe six. But I do have to blot underneath or else my makeup will start running or like my mascara will like put dots under my eyes. I don't know how to explain it. But yeah, that's, I got an extra one of those. Here's, I got a mascara. This is my favorite. This is a CoverGirl Lash Blast waterproof mascara. I always thought I have a backup of those. And my favorite uh, foundation right now is a L'Oreal True Match and the Cover Cover Color W4. So I, those are just repurchases. I just got those again because I need extras. And um, dry shampoo because I do not wash my hair every day. I wash it maybe twice a week, once a week. Ooh, that's kind of being gross, but. I'm gonna wash it at least twice a week. Um, but I get dry shampoo and this is a Batiste. I love this stuff, it's cheap, it's affordable and it works good. And I buy this at Ulta. And this is a dark and deep brown. And it smells good. I got two of these, the caps off of it because my kids are playing with my stuff again. And what else do I get? From Ulta I got uh, It. Cosmetics blending brush. You guys can see the brush head on there. It's really fluffy. It's about the size of my pinky. It's soft and it's, I love it. I've been using it since I bought it. And I got a Palladio <laughs> um, lip pencil. And this is just like a little bit darker than my lips. I just wanted one that was a little darker than my lips so I could outline my lips when I wear my lip gloss. And I got this um, Rimmel London Provocalypse. Um, yeah, lip gloss and our lip stain. And it says 16 hour wear. I tested it out the other night and it lasted about two hours before it started cracking and then I had to reapply it. But I mean, it does work good. I mean, if you're drinking stuff and eating, I was drinking a lot of water and stuff. So it started to crack because I, I'm always constantly drinking stuff. But I'm sure if you're just going to an event or something and you wanted something that wouldn't come off, even if you ate, buy this. This is awesome. I, yeah, I recommend it. And... Um, this is a drugstore purchase too. I wanted to mention this. It's not even a new purchase. I just been using it a lot. It's the e.l.f. lip exfoliator and it looks like a lipstick and mine looks a little bit gross right now because I use it a lot. It's just, it's, I swear it's brown sugar. <laughs> I don't know what else is in it. I didn't look at the ingredients, but my lips get chapped a lot, especially in the winter time. So I just rub it on there and I just keep going back and forth and then when I get like a good coat I just go over it with my finger and rub it in and it takes off all the like the dry cracked skin off of there so that when you wear lipstick or lip gloss you can't see how chapped and ugly your lips are. It just takes off all that skin and then you wipe it off with the toilet paper or something. That's I love it. I wanted to, I wanted to suggest that to you guys. Okay from Sephora. <laughs> Okay, from Sephora, I got the Giant. Shush, the Lit <laughs> Cosmetics um, Glitter Kit. Um, I've seen a lot of YouTube videos on this product right here. It's glitter, and I wanted a glitter that wasn't, that was legit. I didn't want like a shabby glitter. 
It comes with this little brush applicator. It comes with the glitter. I only got one color and it's Summer Sparkle. It's just a silver fine glitter. And it comes with a little bitty bottle of glitter, glitter, clear liquid glitter base. And you just dip the brush inside. I'll do a tutorial with this, but, and I'll show you guys how awesome that this product is. But I really wanted a glitter because I want to start doing um, makeup for high schoolers and doing like prom looks and stuff. So I'm going to try to invest in some more of this. I didn't make a big purchase from Sephora. I just wanted like one or two things really, really bad. The other thing that I got was the Kat Von D Monarch palette. I've been wanting this forever and ever and ever and I finally got it. It was one of the first palettes that I wanted. I just had to invest in it, I guess. I don't know. Take my sweet old time buying it. But it it's really pretty. It looks like that and it has three highlighting shadows up here. This one's a little bit of a silvery, um, shiny one. This is like a cream one with some sparkle in it. Not too bad, it's just um, has a nice sheen to it. This one's a matte cream shadow. And the, the reason I bought this palette is for this one shadow right here. That was two swipes of that freaking orange shadow. And that's how it looks. Like, I don't know, I just love it. And the black, you know, Kat Von D is all about her, you know, her colors and her tattoos and stuff. Look at that. That shadow is just awesome. I feel like it's it's an awesome black. And all the other sh shadows in this palette are really pretty. And yeah, those are my purchases from Sephora. I just got two things. Oh, and I forgot I got three samples. You always get samples and you get to pick what you want, but I got a Smashbox primer. I got a Clinique acne solutions one and a purity sample. So it's actually all the things that I've been wanting to try. So anyways. Now for my BH Cosmetics, um, I got quite a bit from BH Cosmetics. I feel like it's quite a bit for me because I only get like one or two things when I online shop. I don't like to get a whole bunch. I just ordered just enough for the free shipping. But I got a foundation and concealer palette and I've been wanting this because I wanted something that I can mix and match for people when I do their makeup. And I just, I haven't tested it or anything yet. It's brand new and it comes with this little protector thingy. And all the shadows, you can see that they get pretty dark and they're cream. They're cream, it's obviously cream because it's foundations and concealer. But I'll be doing a tutorial with this too. I'm gonna test it on myself or maybe on somebody else and then that way I could just use it on clients and that's exactly what I bought it for is just for people when I do their makeup and I got a brush set from BH Cosmetics as well I forget what this brush set is called and I already threw away the box and all it says on it is BH Cosmetics it doesn't even give a description like on the brushes itself but there's five big brushes and there's five smaller brushes so there's a pointed crease brush, like some blending brushes. They're really um, dense and soft. And these brushes right here, this one would be used for like a concealer. This one's for foundation. Angled brush, angled kabuki would be for foundation. This one would probably be for foundation, liquid ones or bronzer or blush. And this one could be like for a contour because it's really kind of thin and it's fluffy and it's just really pretty and I also got this blending brush from BH Cosmetics I just wanted one single blending brush and it's a it's a big fat fluffy one it's kind of bigger than my pinky and it's like big and fluffy and I just wanted it to blend out the lines of my makeup so I don't have harsh lines and I got a eyeliner it's a waterproof gel eyeliner pencil. I just wanted to check it out because I like finding new eyeliners that, you know, that you could use in a pencil and they ain't gonna go anywhere. I have one from, no, it's from Milani and it's pretty legit, I love it. And this one is the BH Studio Pro Matte Finish Press Powder. 
and I just kind of winged it when I was guessing my color and it came it comes in this little compact and on the bottom you have a little sponge applicator and then on top you have your powder and a mirror and this powder is in my exact color don't stop it and I have one more thing this is the BH Cosmetics bombshell bronze and this is in the color diva and I've been seeing like reviews of it on YouTube and I heard it got pretty good reviews it's matte so there's no shimmer in it and I love bronzers I'm always buying bronzers I I just now figured that out because I have a whole drawer full of bronzers and powders but yeah that's this one and that's all I got so anyways just wanted to share with you guys see you guys later and if you guys have any suggestions or you want to see me using any of the stuff that I did show you guys leave it in the comments bye